Bitcoin, BTC, and the broader crypto market went into a sharp sell-off over the past day, led lower by a pegging of the partially BTC-backed stablecoin Terraud, UST, and a falling risk sentiment globally. At the time of writing, then 30 UTC, BTC was down by 5. 5% over the past 24 hours to 31 US dollars, 512, having trimmed some of its losses from Monday when it dipped as low as 29 US dollars, 730. At the same time, Ethereum, ETH, was down too. 2% for the past 24 hours to 2 US dollars, 384, also up from its Monday low of 2 US dollars, 200. The selling led to massive liquidations of leveraged Bitcoin long positions across exchanges, with about 193 million US dollars liquidated in the 12 hours from noon to midnight hot time on Monday. The liquidations in crypto came as stocks globally also went into deep red territory, with the US S&P 500 index losing 3.2% on Monday and the technology-heavy Nasdaq index shedding 4.3%. Among the more notable developments over the past 24 hours was seen by the USD stablecoin, which lost its US dollar peg and fell to as low as 0 US dollars. 67 before its recovery started. The event forced the team behind the stablecoin to act and lend out BTC to a trading firm that is likely to have sold it to defend the UST peg. The selling in crypto over the past day has brought the so-called Crypto Fear and Greed Index, which measures sentiment from across the crypto market, to extreme fear with a reading of 10. Throughout its history, dating back to early 2018, the index has only been below 10 on a few occasions. Among these was the COVID-19 related crash in March 2020, and the final capitulation of the 2018 bear market in November that year. Meanwhile, Bitcoin bull Michael Saylor's firm MicroStrategy is also in the news today, after reports that the company's profit on its massive Bitcoin investment dropped sharply. According to Saylor's latest purchase announcement, the company's average purchase price for its enormous Bitcoin stack is about 30 US dollars, 700. The news that MicroStrategy's investment had turned into a loss was nonetheless widely reported on Monday, with some reports pointing to a margin call level for the firm at a BTC price of around 21 US dollars. The margin call in question refers to a loan MicroStrategy took out at Silvergate Bank in March for 205 million US dollars. As of April 4, MicroStrategy held BTC 129, 218 in its reserves, 